Good afternoon, Infinity users. Uh, just a quick video here on what I did for my JTEC laser mount. Uh, the factory mount here is this black guy. Uh, the problem is when you've got that on there, it kind of gets in the way for doing bit changes. So I guess most people have been actually taking it off, undoing the screws and taking it off. Uh, one other fellow I saw made a longer version of this plate. Uh, I just wanted to go a different route, thought it was a little cleaner and a little, little easier, less stuff in the way of the dust hose and that. Uh, so I just made a simple male female block mount, magnetic mount. Uh, I used Corian, you could do this out of wood as well. So this is uh, just the male, male channels there that uh, engage the female slots there. Uh, it's super tight, goes on there really nice and tight. No movement really, like just a hair. I, I probably could have made it a little tighter, but uh, you need to be able to get it on and off. So Anyway, that's uh, what I've done. I'll put the files on the Facebook group, maybe up on the forum as well. Uh, they're just 2D files I did in Aspire. Um, I don't have a 3D printer, so I didn't really see the point in doing the STL files. I think uh, someone else has done a similar mount and uh, put the SEL files on the Facebook group. I'm not positive, but uh, I didn't really have a look at them. Uh, so yeah, that's my solution. Pretty simple, nice and clean. Hope uh, it helps some of you out. Have a great day.